Letting the shooters get too many open looks. I think they were 11 for 20 at half, and uh, out of those 11, I think seven were off of missed coverages. Um, and this is a team, the main team in the league, that takes advantage of mistakes. And so, obviously, they got high-level shooters and, and great execution, and uh, we were poor on our coverage. And for the most part, I mean, in the first half, shot 55% from both the field and three. When, when you talk about some of those mistakes, was it a less intensity to or focus maybe than some of the past games where that just wasn't the way you just, this went, this team went? Yeah, I think it's a little bit of that, but also, like I said, when if you make those mistakes against Golden State, they're going to make you pay. So even if it was the same or a little bit less, uh, it stands out because of the shooters they have and some of the actions they run. So um, our attention to detail, to your point, was not the best. Alpern obviously wasn't feeling 100%, but still had a pretty great game. What did you see from him that impressed you? Yeah, same thing he did when he was hurt with the ankle and pushed through it. And, um, you know, he, he, he loves to play in the games, obviously, and wasn't feeling his best early. You could see it a little bit on his lift. And, uh, you know, he got loose as, as we went and had another great game. So love that part, um, him, you know, having resiliency to push through. And, and, you know, you're either injured and can't play or you got some pain and you can kind of push through it. And he's done that a few times this year. So uh, kudos to him. What led to the decision to hold Jalen out of the whole fourth quarter? The group that was in was playing better, and that had a good spark there. Uh, obviously, scored 35 in that quarter, and just like the energy.